Ah. Wow, that silo is, uh, really, really loud. Darn, we should put it at the other farm. Maybe we should take it down. Yes, it is a very, very cold day of December. Um, a couple months have gone by. Some new stuff is going on. I'm actually going to pick up a plow for this thing. Um, got the plow mount on it already. Actually, I bought the plow mount with the truck. Um, I just gotta go put it on. It's at the, at the store. Hopefully we can get some snow. Um, but yeah. Oh, this is just a sexy, sexy beast. Ooh, whew. I just can't get over how this sounds. Um, might need to put a little bit of weight in the back. Um, I mean, it's something maybe that we're gonna have to do. Got power now. Just click the little remote and it closes. So that's really nice. That was the one thing. Um, I guess we can stop by, uh, Old Grandpa's farm, which, well, it's kind of my farm. Well, it's kind of my dad's. It's, it's, it's actually kind of just everybody's, to be honest. Um, but we'll stop over there and see everything. Um, kind of rented a skid loader and adjusted some things. Put a couple buildings up. Took a old uh, building down. I'm sorry, man. Um, took an old building down over there at, uh, I don't know, family farm. Uh, and then, you know, put took down some of them old fences. There's no need to have those. Um, as you guys can see, it's just right there. Put up a... We want to have some sheep, some pigs, and some cows. So that's what we're going to be getting. But, um... We'll just pull into here and show you all real quick. Um... So this is our pigs. Um... We still have to go pick them up. Um, this is our sheep. Um, we're delivering, we're gonna have, I think, like, 10 or 15 sheep getting delivered or something. Um, over here is our huge cow pasture. Um, we'll come up here and here's the loft and everything. Um, here's where we put our food in. And here's where the cows will be. Well, maybe this is our food. This is where our food's gonna be. I'm probably just going to be doing some meat cows, um, manure or slurry, um, but yeah, very, very old style, um, type of, like, shed, like, they used to do this ramp to go up to the thing, um, yeah, very, very cool, actually, I, I actually, like, it's amazing, I love this old style, it's, it's like, like, 1960s, almost. But yeah, it looks very, very old. It looks really cool, too. Now, coming over here, we have our case. 145 horsepower. Or maybe it's 115 horsepower. Magmum. Maximum. Whatever you want to call it. Um, we have our... Oh, I'm stuck in here. Too fat to get through there. We have our... <laughs> we have our, um, our class baler. This one was actually a little used. Couple hours on it. Um has the wrapper in the back so we can make, um, silage with it. And we have our, um, I think it's, uh, this, the machine that, I can't think of it, but this is the wind drawer and this is the other thing. This thing flips it over, lets it dry, this is, like, makes it into rows. This is our silage maker, you put, um, like, this is how you make TMR, so you throw silage, hay, and, um, Silo chain straw under there, and then this is our little wagon for picking up cows and everything. Um, but yeah, very, very cool. And we'll be, uh, I, wa I was kind of wanting to get, like, a plow attachment to this thing, but, you know, getting one for the F-150, we'll just drive over here and plow it out, you know. It'll be very, very nice to get one for F-150. I want to get one that's pretty strong, too. But yeah, it'd be so nice to just come over here, plow it out. Um, we might go pick up some animals today. Um, but we don't really have any feeds. So we're gonna have to buy some stuff from the store, which we might do. We'll probably do. Throw a couple bales in the, the bed of the F-150. If you guys are enjoying these types of videos, make sure you guys like, subscribe, hit the bell for post notifications so you don't miss any of them. Um, yeah, I just hope you guys really enjoy them. And, uh, yeah, enjoy the rest of the video. You know, you know, Steve's dealership got... It has, like, an app on your phone. He has, like, everything that he has here. I think we want to go to 
winter equipment. He does have some snowblowers and stuff, but, um, I was kind of looking over here at this side, and I was going to look at this, uh, this one, Western Wide Out Plow. I think it would be really nice. Um, can get the Fisher, but I think the Western is, like, a better built. I think it's actually, um, American made, so I think we're going to go ahead down here. Bottom right corner, we can have it be delivered. Um, and I think what we're gonna do is we're just gonna head over here. Um, uh, I can get silage, but the one thing I can't get is straw. So let's just get one straw bale. Let's just buy one bale of everything. One silage bale. And then let's come over here and buy one hay bale. Load everything up in the F-150, and there'll be some nice weight in the back for the plow, so that will be good. I think it should be just right over there. Yeah, there is everything. We'll just, I guess, I guess we can just go ahead and hook up the plow. I mean, we're already paid for everything, so. Let's go up here. I'll have to get around, attach the pins, line it just a little better. Alright, here we go. She's all hooked up. She looks like a sexy beast. Um, now we gotta load these bales up. Let's see. Okay, so I lifted it up, but it does squat the truck a little bit. Um, you know, five and a half foot bed, kind of shorter frame, so I don't, I wouldn't imagine it would squat it too much, you know. I'm gonna have to drop this tailgate. I'm just messing with some of the controls here. That's the turn it. Well, I guess we'll have to throw our bales right into here. Have to kind of stack them up. Oh, come on now. Here we go. My bed's kind of a little messed up. Um, with our 5,000 liters of silage. Wow. We're gonna have to have our hazards for this. Even though it's just like right across the road. Um, yeah, this is a lot of weight for the F-150. <laughs> Like, a little too much, maybe. Just a little extreme. Definitely have to throw a couple straps over these. <laughs> well, hey, it sits about level now. I mean, that's probably like, I don't know, 500 pounds of bail, maybe? I don't know. I mean, yeah. Yeah, 9,000 liters of straw, 8,000 liters of grass, and 5,000 liters of silage. Um, somebody comment down below how much weight that is. I mean, it levels out the F-150 pretty well, but, you know, firing simulator doesn't really have good realistic, um, physics, so, you know. But it's just good so I don't drag this, um, plow on the, you know, like, pavement, break my truck, my plow. We just have our hazards on right now. Kind of having a hard time driving. This plow's kind of catching the ground a little bit. Might have to... I have to do something about that. Don't really know what we can do. Definitely catching the ground. Definitely catching the ground. Won't even really go over like 30. Got a lot of weight. This F 150's doing it though. Alright, um, we're here. I guess we should put our bales. Well, if we're all gonna load it in right away, we'll just unstrap it and unload everything. Well, there we go. We'll, uh, we'll get this thing. I will fire it up. And we don't need to let things warm up. We're alright. We'll just do what we need to do. Um, now, I can get the TMR mixed up, but I'm gonna go pick up some cows, actually. I wish I had my 6M over here instead of this thing. Kinda really don't like cases, to be honest with you. Kinda hard to drive. Don't really have that good of a cab view, but I guess that's on the way, in the way, so. These bales aren't really heavy enough. Um, just turn this on, probably just drop them all into there, I guess. We'll just throw it in there. Throw it in there, all right. Let's see here, where it's all mixing up. Sorry if we only get a little bit of um, TMR. That's, that's fine, okay. We'll throw our little bit of straw a little bit. Just a little bit. 
Probably that much, maybe? We'll have to see. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that will work. Alright, um. I aggressively threw the bale here. Um, if anybody's asking how I'm picking up these bales, uh, I have a strong farmer. Um, link down in the description if you wanted, if you play, uh, Farming Simulator on PC. Anyways, I think we should, um, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna, oh, oh, great. Well, that just, it's great, actually. Um, I'm gonna fold up that tailgate. I think we're gonna hook on, um, we're gonna go get some, maybe just beef cows, probably just beef cows. That's, that's what's worth it nowadays. Go over here and load them right up here. Um, <clears throat> uh, I just, uh, just want to show you guys something real quick. Um, this right here is just right in the middle of a field. So there is actually no animal dealer, but it's, it's fine. The animal dealer, I thought, used to be somewhere up here, maybe. Or, like, maybe it was somewhere down down here by, like, 32 or something. So, um, I just have to come in here and just unfold it. So we got five Linson beef cows, and we're gonna get five Angus cows. So, um, that's pretty good a little amount, I guess. Um, we have to get around here, get them some food. Ooh, this is gonna be kind of hard. I should really get rid of this rest of this fence. Me and Dad were out here just getting the rest of the fence, but never, uh, I really finished uh, getting all of it. We kind of want to just leave that, I guess. Um, Alright. That should be mixed enough. Um, I'm just going to come right around here. I'm going to get it. This case, it's having a hard time pulling this. I'm surprised. Like, I'm generally surprised. I've never seen that before. But we'll just... I'll just get in here. Kind of have too big of a fort front loader for the sucker. That's all right. I'll just get into here. There we go. They're getting some of their food. we get up. They got their little bit of water there. Um, let's see. So it did a little bit. Um, we're gonna have to get some. Uh, there's, okay, we're gonna have to get them some hay and grass bales, but, um, for right, right now, that should be, that should be pretty good for right now, I would say. I mean, it's not, it's not really too bad, I guess, um, but I'm definitely gonna leave this up, and we're probably gonna have to get them our load of TMR, but, um, yeah, I hope everybody enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you guys like, subscribe, and the bell for post notifications while I have this stupid thing in the way. Um, if you enjoyed, make sure you guys like, subscribe. <laughs> I got distracted from that light pole. Um, everybody enjoyed, uh, make sure you like, subscribe, and the bell for post notifications. Make sure you share the video. And yeah, um, you see, you're, you know I'm saluting. So we'll see you guys next time. Wade Farms.